Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Chef John, Rebecca's behind the camera. I was researching some uh, pies, it was kind of going around the internet, well, on the news lately around here, about a uh, shoe fly pie. So uh, I'm like, man, that's made out of molasses. I knew I never had one, but I know it's made out of molasses. I'm like, man, there's something a little tamer than that. Maybe there's a honey pie. And sure enough, I researched and there's quite a, not a lot of recipes on this, but a few. So we're gonna go ahead and make this. Later on, I'll make that uh, shoe fly pie. And uh, coming up soon is a apple pan dowdy. So that's the song, shoe fly pie and apple uh, pan dowdy. Makes your eyes light up and your tummy say howdy. I don't know if you ever heard that, but that's what I'm being a little funny, but that's the song. All right, let's go make this pie. All right, we've got a, what is this? Eight and a half or a nine inch pan. I don't know. It's a pie pan we bought it uh, at a local grocery store. We also got a Pillsbury or the local store uh, pie crust. You can make your own if you want to. We're trying to make this easy for you and easy for me. So we're gonna go ahead and get our crust down in here, just spread it out so it reaches the bottom. And you can do the edge however you want. You can flute it, you can pinch it up like I'm doing right here. Doesn't have to be all pretty. And then the next thing we're going to do, we're going to poke some holes in this. Eh, it's not too bad. It's not perfect, not too bad. All we have is a, we're at my work kitchen, so all we have is a plastic spoon, something we forgot to bring. Let's poke some holes in it. It's called docking the pie. Docking the pie. I'm going to do a few on the side. Now, Again, we, we didn't bring anything to hold the pie down, but we, we're pretty creative around here. So what we're gonna do, once we got it docked, we got our oven on 350. So we're going to set, just to hold it down, put some weight on it, we're just gonna put a, another pan on top of it and we're gonna stick a little pampered chef bowl on top of it. That should hold it down pretty good and, and get the pie uh, baked. And we're gonna bake this for, uh, what did you say? 20. 20 minutes. So let's go ahead and get this in the oven and we'll start on some of the other stuff. So we're gonna put some uh, heavy cream in here. And we're gonna put some uh, just regular milk, right? Or is it half and half? Regular milk. Yeah, so regular milk and some uh, heavy cream. And we're going to take this to the stove and we're going to heat it on medium-low heat until it starts steaming. And that's as far as we're going to cook this. All right, we're going to add the honey. It's a little warm, so I'm going to just get it in there and let it cool just a second because we want to make sure it's good and... Uh, liquefied and we don't want it solid but we don't put our eggs in there until it cools just a tad so we don't cook them and to help cool it off we'll put the eggs in last so we'll go ahead and put some uh, brown sugar and granulated sugar in here okay we'll put a pinch of salt we got some sea salt we'll go ahead and put some uh, vanilla in here. Go ahead and put the cornstarch in here. And we'll mix this up and then uh, we'll add the eggs like one at a time until we get it going. So we're going to do this on low. I don't know how fast one this one is, but. And that warm honey will help the sugar dissolve a little bit too ahead of time. A little bit at a time, an egg at a time.
And I'll show you, I don't know if you can see down in here, but I'll show you the batter when I, when I get this mixed up. And we're going to add the last egg. All right, as you can see, I don't know if you can see it, but we've got the, the milk just barely steaming. We'll turn our mixer on. We're going to slowly drizzle this in here. this back in this stock pot and we're going to heat this on that medium heat for about eight minutes. Very smooth, no lumps. That means we need to put the eggs, we've done good tempering them. Covered up. This is just like a little pudding. Beautiful custard. Very smooth. I'm not worried about. You're supposed to push it through a sieve, but we're okay. All right, we baked our pie crust at 350. So now we've bumped it up to 375. We're going to cook this for 12 to 15 minutes, or until the edges are firm and the center is still jiggly. So I'm off to the oven. a great way to start a Monday morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Breakfast with champions. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Like, share, and subscribe for more videos like this. Have and most important, y'all come back. Come back. We'll see you Bye. soon.